the youngest driver on the Formula 1 grid has extended his contract for another year. Yes, it's Yuki Tsunoda. This shows that Red Bull continues to have faith in the young Japanese driver, even though he's had a bit of an accident-prone season so far. So hello and welcome to Fervent Motorsports. Today I'm going to talk to you about the new Yuki Tsunoda deal and what this means for Alpha Tauri. Alpha Tauri announced that they are keeping Sonoda on the grid for another year. He joined Formula 1 in 2021 with Alpha Tauri itself, and this is just his second season in the sport. So speaking on why the team decided to keep him, here's what the team boss Franz Torst had to say. As I always say, a driver needs at least three years to fully get to grips with Formula 1. So I'm pleased that he's been given the time to show his full potential. It's a testament to Dr. Marco and his driver program that we are able to bring these young talents up from the junior categories and develop them. I'd like to join Yuki in thanking Red Bull, Alpha Tauri, as well as Honda for their continuous support and for allowing him to stay with us for another year. Now, team boss Franz Toss knows what he's talking about. He's been at the team for a while and he has seen the meteoric rise of drivers such as Sebastian Vettel, Daniel Ricciardo and even Max Verstappen. This is why he believes that Sonoda is the right fit for the team. Many people will be arguing that Sonoda crashes a lot and that he loses his cool quite a bit. But the same was said about Verstappen when he joined Formula 1 back in the day. It's important to remember that Sonoda was born in 2000. He's just 21 years old and he's maturing as the seasons progress. This season, his car has not been the greatest with the team struggling overall. Speaking on his new deal, Sonora said, Having moved to Italy last year to be closer to the factory, I feel really part of the team. And I'm glad I get to carry on racing with them in 2023. Of course, our 2022 season isn't over yet. And we are still pushing hard in the midfield battle. So I'm fully focused on finishing it on a high and we will look forward to next year. According to an article published by Sportrack, Yuki Tsunoda is one of the least paid drivers on the grid. He's paid around $750,000 per year. Now that's not a small amount of money for sure, but it shows you that he's willing to earn less in order to make his Formula 1 dream come true. Although a few months back, Alpha Tauri announced that Pierre Gasly would be a part of the team next year, they haven't mentioned him in the Sonora press release. This could mean that the team itself is unsure if Gasly will continue with them or if he could move to Alpine. So thank you for watching this video by Fervent Motorsports. Do remember to like, share and subscribe. And as always, stay tuned to our channel as we get you the best of motorsport news.